Hello everyone, welcome to another episode of J Bros Cooking and today we are making leftover breakfast tacos. And we are still in Arkansas on our barbecue tour, but the Airbnb we rented, the guy um, left some stuff so we could use it. And so we are going to use some of the things we found with some potatoes that he had. He had some eggs and then we have some meats right here. This was left over from a barbecue review we did yesterday. So we have some leftover ribs, some brisket, some pulled pork, and then we also had done some tacos. And I figured, you know what? We're doing tacos anyways. But the chicken is great. Has some diced onions, some cilantro in there. We did bring some of our own spices. We came prepared. We had mm. like we had some J Bro spices, but uh, the rest was all spices that were here in the Airbnb. So we're gonna go ahead and get this heated up. We're gonna drop some oil in there. So I'm just gonna go ahead and add these potatoes into the oil here. So for spices for our potatoes, we're gonna go ahead and do the J Rose SPG. Then we're also gonna go, I found this steakhouse seasoning in there. And this just got, looks like it's got a little bit of everything. We're gonna go ahead and get a little bit of this in there too. All right, then our potatoes are gonna take a bit of time to go, so I'm gonna transfer the potatoes back there, let them keep cooking, and then we'll move on with our meat. All right, now, we're gonna heat up the meat, and we're just gonna mix all the meat together. So Joe's got a little butter. Just gonna throw this in. We're just gonna take the meats and uh, throw them in the pan here. Like we said, for the meats, we're just mixing them all together. Ooh, sizzling. So that was the chicken. This is the pulled pork. This is the rib meat. Rib meat. And this is the brisket. And we're gonna season these up. They already got a lot of flavor on them. Let me start with some pepper here. Hit it with a little bit of onion powder. And I'm just feeling these out. A little barbecue rub. Go ahead and do a little SPG too. Just a lot of, you know. We hit it with black pepper already, but we like black pepper, so. Hit it with a little bit more flavor. All right. Get them all mixed mm -hmm. up. All right, so potatoes went about 10 minutes. They're getting nice and brown. I like my potatoes real crispy. What do you want for spice, Joe? Ooh, give me a little black pepper. Black pepper. I'm assuming salt, I use the black pepper. And then... Okay. So we're gonna go ahead and heat up some tortillas. We got some flour and some corn. Build our breakfast tacos. So, ooh, what would I do? Yeah, well, I actually put a little bit of cheese on the bottom one. All right, just a little bit. Don't overdo it. So we'll do that for all of them. And I know this is not traditional taco. I know everyone. This is a leftover breakfast Airbnb taco. Taco. We don't have any salsa. 
We were actually at our friend's house the other day and he made about a gallon of it and we didn't take him. I thought that, and I really did think to take some last night because I knew we were going to make these for breakfast and I completely But that. we do have one of the best ones here. So for hot sauce? For store-bought hot sauce. What I'm going to do is swim that is this bad boy right here. Give this a try. This is good. Throw in when you're cooking something too. And this is not like the hottest hot sauce in the world, but it has a great flavor. Yeah, this just comes through. It's like, mm. So we got our tacos all done. We're here at the Airbnb. And we figured, you know what? We're gonna enjoy these tacos outside. We got a nice little lake here. Mm. We'll never own anything like this, so we might as well enjoy it while we yeah. can. I'll own it through Airbnb for a day or two at a time. All right, John's I'm doing a corn. John's gonna do a flour. Mm. Mm. Guys, this is really good. Just simple leftover ingredients, and I mean, for the meat, it could be anything. And that's what we're. Sometimes that's what we're trying to show you. We're literally we're staying at Airbnb. This is a great meal, and literally it was just leftovers and stuff that was already in the house. And that's how simple cooking can be. That's the way I enjoy doing it. Mm. Yeah, cooking doesn't always have to be, I think that's the problem with like all the stuff on TV. It always seems like it's an award show and you know, it's good to have really beautiful looking food, but you can have really good food too. It's just simple, simple stuff. A little off subject, but like, we, this is one of the things, the reasons why when traveling, when you can, because it, it is expensive, like we're splitting it, but staying in Airbnb is nice because you cook your own food. You don't have to eat out all the time. Save some money. Spend some money, save some money, I don't know. Depends on where you're staying. You could be spending, I guess, either way. If a hotel's yeah. in a good area and an Airbnb is in a good area, you're gonna spend some money. You know, originally the idea had been, when Joe was saying, you know, it's just simple as cooking what you got, we had said, we were gonna do breakfast burritos, but the tacos, they was taco size tortillas that we found, so. We adapted. Breakfast tacos, and they're delicious. Appreciate it if you give us a like and subscribe. Follow us on all of our social media, J Bros Cooking, Facebook, Instagram, and TikTok find all of our recipes on our website jboscooking.com and like we always say Joey it's always better when you make it yourself jbros out